All right, y'all, so today, as y'all heard from the first video, is the second video of the day. Now I'm here, back here at the actual gym, and I'm gonna be showing you guys shoulders and back exercises that you guys should be doing and ones that I do. So it's gonna be a little bit of calisthenics and some weight training. So let's get into the very first exercise. All right, so we're gonna be starting out with simple pull-ups. Now, if you guys can't do pull-ups, what you wanna do is perfect your grounding. So you can either do more push-ups or you can just start out by doing a pull-up hold. So you just hold on part of this. You can do scapular pull-ups, only using your back. But to get to an actual complete pull-up, you have to do more push-ups and at least get to one rep. So since it's easy for me, when I fuck up my calluses, I'll be doing them weighted. Now, I always usually start out with 10, but I'm gonna be starting out with 25 this time, just to make it harder. Second workout of the day, so you gotta push yourself. Now, the gym, the gym always wins, but you gotta put a good, fair fight up against it. Now, you try to do at least five reps. So I don't really use that pull up, but this one's more straight, so I'll be doing this one. First exercise, pull ups or weighted pull ups. So, get it back in. Get it. So the position you want to get them is at shoulder width. You don't want to be too wide out or too in or too near, but to hit your, your latch right here, make them explode, you want to go right here, shoulder width. So, not all the way out. You can do different variations, but if you really want to begin it, if you're really a beginner, you try to start out right here. And it makes it easier pulling the weight off. So, let's get right to it. That was five reps. Now you can either drop set it or you can keep on going at least to 10. But some advanced, I'm gonna be trying to go on 10 reps. You take rest, as much rest as you need, but no more than one or two minutes. So now, after you did 10 reps, you can either do three to five sets on those, or what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be drop plating. So, about three, four sets, but the very last one you're gonna be doing that body weight. So, let's do those. Go. Mm. So I did all my sets already, so now we're going to be moving on to 
overhead dumbbell press. So all you need is a pair of dumbbells, a bench. So you want to sit down, you want to angle the bench to where it's straight up. So the heavier you go on this one, the more strength you get, the bigger your shoulders are going to get. So if you complain that your shoulders aren't growing, but you're doing 25 on the incline shoulder press, you see why. So I'm going to be starting out with 35s. This one helps target, pretty sure the mid delt and the front delt. So you can either do sets or rotate them out. You could do this one, and then after this one, I'm gonna be rotating it out with the overhead, the standing overhead straight bar press. Heavy on it. Oh.